Hi guys, Kelly here again, and today I have for you Twyla from Freak the Freak Du Chic line. So, um, I talked a little bit in my haul video about how they weren't available in the U.S. when the uh, a line the line originally first came out. So I don't know why they weren't, but who cares? I have her now. Let's dig in. Uh, here is a shot of the back of the box, and I will bring it closer so you guys can pause and read. And I'm not actually going to angle down like I do. We're just going to I'm going to kind of hold the box up. And dig right in. And she comes with her little bunny Dustin. I think that's his name. It's actually a light like turquoise. It's not green like it's showing up. All right. So, I don't know why my camera is so weird being weird today. So here she is. Her hair is really, uh, it's really, really just, I don't know how to explain it. It's really curly. I mean, you can see that, of course, for yourselves. But the feeling is, it's, of course, really, really gelled or hairsprayed in place. But, which is fine. I mean, I'm not going to do it. So I love her little outfit. She looks like a little Harley Quinn. Uh, she would actually look like Harley Quinn if she were in black and red instead of black and teal. So here's her little... Oh, just her little... It's, I guess it would be called a romper. I think these are what things are called, the rompers. So it's made out of tulle and a little satin. Uh, she is missing her arm right here, but that's okay. It's down here. I have it. And then she has little spiders and little pom poms. Those are so cute. I mean, creepy but cute. Let's let's say it for what it is. It's it's cute but creepy. And then she has these huge, long, freaking stilts. Let's move this. You can see. See, there's the stilts. And I don't know if you can see them, but and they the stilts actually do come off her her leg. The the they do come off. They kind of look like, it looks like someone took the banister off of a really fancy staircase and added, uh, like, brass, or not brass, but added some, like, wrought iron to it and welded it all together. It's cool, but, so, and then these are her normal shoes, which match, of course, that's not what it was, <laughs> Which match, they match the, um, her, they match these things right here. They speak so good, right? And they literally just kind of, here, let's see if I can show you. They just kind of, uh, there's a hole inside there. I don't know if you, how well you can see it. There you go. You can, you can kind of see that there's a hole in there. And that right there goes, just slides right in there. It just kind of snaps down inside there. And... It stays. So it stays. And the one thing I was worried about Twyla is that when you get when you, if you have a 13 wishes Twyla, you'll notice that she has uh, lines like smoky lines or wispy lines that go down her leg. And I was really worried that they weren't going to have them, but they do. So I'm really excited about that. What I really think is really unique about this doll is the little like capes that go down the legs. I was wondering how they were going to add that in because if you've seen any of the reviews or my reviews of Twyla or <laughs> the Freak Du Chic line is that they all have this material down in their costumes somehow. So I was really interested to see how, they're, how they were going to have it in Twyla's costume. And I really like the fact that they have the little capes behind 
on like on her leggings. I think that's really really cute. And I think it's really inventive how they did that. And of course she's taller than every other doll except for maybe Calliope or um oh I think it's it's the Sasquatch lady. I can't remember her name right now. So yeah, she stands uh, I think most all stand at 12 inches and Goliope 17 so she stands about 14 inches I'm not gonna go over and get Goliope and test her so <clears throat> but yeah guys tell me what you think about this about her outfit isn't it it's or just even her like, what's up with the hair? She doesn't normally... Well, she has gray, like, little gray hairs. Or it's actually purple. I thought it was purple. And I love her makeup, and I love her face. I'm sorry the lighting sucks, as always. And next Christmas, instead of dolls, I should get lighting. Maybe for my birthday. Send me lighting! No. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I love her outfit. It's got spiders on it, and webs, and it's creepy, and it's cute. You don't know whether to go, ah or ew. Which I think is the whole point. Her outfit is, I don't know, it's very French. Like French jesters or harlequins. The stilts don't quite, aren't quite working very well. Anyways guys, uh, let me know what you think about her in the comments down below. And give me a thumbs up and subscribe. It costs nothing. It's absolutely free. And she does come with a stand and a brush. Oh no, she actually doesn't come with a brush. Oh, I almost forgot. She comes with a card, a poster. That says Twilight Boogeyman on it. So yeah guys, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Subscribe and just be my friend. And don't ever forget to continue to be you. Always be who you are. And I love you guys and stay beautiful. Bye.